Today's episode is brought to you by NordVPN. See this guy? This is you. You're handsome, kind of. You're browsing the internet, doing whatever it is your weird ass does, and that's fine, except- Oh, what's that? Is that- Is that your ISP staring in at you, watching literally everything you do from your window? Man, I bet you they'd love to tell everyone what you're up to. Except look at this. You just used code JIMMY with NordVPN and got a 68% discount on a two-year plan. Now it's installed on your computer, and they can't see a damn thing. They know you're still using your computer, but they don't know what you're up to now. On top of that, you could be anywhere for all they know, New York, Toronto, China, who knows, they, they don't. NordVPN has super fast servers with no data logging, giving you all the freedom you want with no peeping toms. Go to nordvpn.com slash Jimmy or use code J1MMY to get 68% off a two-year plan plus a month free. May 2nd, 2006, Quest 105, Swan Song. This quest is pretty fun and involves the wise old man from Drainer Village. If you don't already know, the wise old man is the NPC that gives out the quest cape, so he holds a very special place in my heart. The wise old man used to be known all around the world. This quest revolves around giving him his last hoorah before he retires. We're heading all the way north of the map up to Piscator's fishing colony. This young lady, Kathy Corcat, has a boat here. It should take us right next to the colony. She's devastated and crying. I'm not sure what's going on. I don't have time for this. It's very dangerous up there. Lucky for me, the ring on my finger makes me very charming. I called her a beautiful lady. Now she's gonna put her life in danger and take me for free. It's a very cool ring. I highly recommend it. Alright, here we are. Herman Carano's. Lovely day, isn't it? The fuck is wrong with this guy's face? What is that? Oh, it's a pipe. His character's model's moving. They definitely just made a stationary pipe. It is not a part of his character model. It's just literally floating in the sky where his mouth slightly is sometimes. His beard matches his boots. I don't like this. He said he's looking for an experienced adventure to help him out. Sounds exactly like me. Let's have a look at you. Go ahead, baby. 213 quest points. It's really rather a lot. That's right. It's literally the max you can have up to this point. In my universe, you were born today. This is your first day alive. That must be very cool for you. This whole place was evacuated because they're having a sea troll problem. He said, even though I'm a qualified adventurer, we need a truly expert adventurer. I'm in the Guild of Legends. He's telling me to stop blowing my own trumpet. Dot, 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 fucker. That's all I have to say to you. He's telling me the wise old man of Drainer is who we need. What do you want with him? Oh, you know him? Yeah, he robs banks. He's a criminal. Oh, here we go. I'm not your mate? Oh my god. He just mur You know what? Actually, respect though, because I would totally do that too. Yeah, yeah, I did that. I just realized, unless there's quest that I don't know about, I've done the same amount of quests as the wise old man. I am just as good of an adventurer as him. Okay, actually, I haven't killed this thing. Never mind. People did not solo that thing in 2006. If they did, they were maxed. Hey, it's dad from the troll quest. Oh, sit down. Okay, let's go get this guy. This dude makes me so uncomfortable all the time. Jesus Christ, he's just staring at me. What the fuck? I told him the fishing colony wanted help, and he's like, oh, they remember me after all. I'm so good and handsome. And I just fucking yawned in his face. Oh my god. He's gonna make this is his swan song, the last hoorah, the big bang before his retirement. He wants 10 lava runes, 10 mist runes, and 5 blood runes. Luckily, I made those things earlier. Combination runes are a pain in the ass to make, but I got it out of the way. This guy knows how to dress. Got at least 7 girlfriends. I gave him the runes, he's gonna meet me over at the colony. He's telling me to arm myself, cause it could be dangerous. Bring food! Remember to bring food! Fucking asshole. Something about this guy just throws me off. I can hear creatures moving around in the trees. <laughs> They're sea trolls. They're not gonna be in the trees. Oh yeah, big stretch. I think something's coming. Ah, would it be those fucking things? Here they come, yes. Let's get after it. Is he strafing? What's the strat here? What are you doing? You know, you don't need to do that. They're not attacking you. You don't need to strafe. You're losing ticks. I'm out of runes. What do you mean you're out of runes? Did you just bring the ones I gave you? I gave you like 15 runes. They're not gonna last very long. You knew we'd be fighting shit. They never stop. Did you just- what did you just throw? He's throwing rocks at them. He's throwing rocks, hitting zeros, and then they aggro me when he hits them. This is so messed up. Got them all. Finally. Good God. Please go tell Herman I'm here. Okay, I guess we're gonna go find this guy. Here he is. Uh, oh fucking K. Did you bring the wise old man? I did. I don't know where he's- was he just invisible standing next to him the entire time? This dude's a psychopath. So there's only like two dudes left in the entire town. One of them is the owner of the general store over here, so we're gonna go help him out. My man Arnold here wants help restocking the general store. We just need to get him five monkfish. So technically, I can start fishing monkfish now, uh, but I'm just probably not gonna ever do that. I'm gonna get this guy his five and then only come back here if I'm absolutely desperate for it. Oh my god, hello. I like how I catch like two monkfish every six hours here, but I still have to fight these trolls and between. I love this. Oh, what a big, 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 
big bitch. Dude, I'm so good at video games, it's ridiculous. Look, I am destroying this thing. I've never hit better in my life. And we got them all, baby. God damn it, he wants them cooked. There's no one here to buy cooked ones. They're gonna go bad. I'm gonna burn at least four. One, look. Two, here it comes the big four. Okay, all right, well, I need to get two more now, so I'll see you tomorrow. Dude, I've been here for so long, I'm not gonna do this anymore. I got two, I was gonna get like another four, but I've been here for so long, I just can't catch them. Please don't burn it, thank you. Thank you so much, dude. Video games, that's all I gotta say. Video games. Yeah, you're welcome, Arnold, no problem. Yeah, I didn't hate that. Now we gotta help Frankie. Cool, I get to fix a wall. Look at me, I know how to do this. I know what I'm doing. I'm putting metal down, I'm, sp I'm cracking, smashing, fucking sucking. <laughs> All right, I figure while we're this early into the episode and I have a little sanity left, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say there's not gonna be a song this episode. I really appreciate your guys' support on all the songs I do. Most of the songs are just a product of me not wanting to edit and procrastinating, so I just go and do an entire other project, and that's how it always is. And there's just sometimes I don't really feel like making a song, and even though the songs are really fun to do, they're not the main point of this series. I plan on doing songs in the future a lot. They're not gonna be in every episode, and this series is a whole lot more than that. That being said, I still have no words for for my appreciation of you guys listening to that stuff. I get comments every video asking to put it on Spotify. They're all there under buy release. Usually the songs get up on Spotify about a week after the episode comes out, and I think that's about it. So yeah, fuck you, no song today. I make songs when I wanna make songs. Let's go fix a goddamn wall. I think the sexiest trait about me is my ability to fix anything. What has someone told me to fix that I haven't? You know, walls, fences, uh, bridges. I don't know. I fix shit, dude. So apparently the wise old man has come up with a big plan to get rid of the trolls. He wants us to combine forces and take down all the trolls at once. The thing is, is there is no force. We have nobody here. There's two people that haven't evacuated this place, and clearly neither of them can fend for themselves. So I have to recruit an entire goddamn army. Where do I start with that? I don't know. But guess what? It's RuneScape. People know magic. We're gonna go see if any magicians want to poof up an army or something. So this is the wizard they wanted me to talk to because he's got these zombies down here. He knows how to make them and produce them in mass quantities. It would be super convenient for this guy to help me out. But since he thinks in a way that isn't completely psychotic, he knows that it's a bad idea to do that. So he is not wanting any part of this. So instead of going about this the smart way, we're going to do some sketchy shit and talk to sketchy people, which is kind of more up my alley. You guys probably remember this dude from Fairy Tale. He's a sketchy necromancer guy. He could care less what anyone thinks about what he does. And that's just the kind of guy we need. He's got these bone seeds. When I put them in a pot and unpack them, they'll spawn skeleton mages and they'll fight who we want them to fight. He wants me to go ask the master craftsman in the crafting guild what the best way to hold the seeds will be, which is gonna be an airtight pot, which I already have. But I like talking to people, I don't mind. You need to chill out more, dude. You know what? I actually, I needed that right now. Thank you. Also, holy shit, this man is high as fuck. Look how high he is. This dude is baked. Oh my god. Okay, he's gonna put the seeds in our pot now. We just have to open it when we need them. Uh... Okay, I didn't realize I was getting teleported here. That's kind of convenient, but but also, can I bank here? Please let me bank. Oh my- I didn't know it was gonna teleport me here. I, I don't have enough food. Can I take him on with this amount of food? One swordfish? Can I take this thing on? Whatever, dude. I'm not a bitch. I'm doing it. I'm ready. Let's fight. This is gonna go so well. Nothing's gonna go wrong here. Oh yeah. How do they know who to attack? Boo. Boo. Yeah, get him. The trolls aren't even hitting back. Zero casualties. Flawless victory. The trolls are dead. Uh, that was like seven of them. I could have done that. Oh god. Sea troll general, huh? Leave this to me? Okay. No complaints from me. Oh my god. Ooh, did you see that? How'd he do that? What happened to him running out of runes? Where was this when I had all those trolls attacking me earlier? I wish I could just pull out some rocks, start chucking them from the sidelines like he did. This thing's health bar is dense. Thank God he's doing that. What? That doesn't add up. My guy's kissing his ass now. And, uh... Oh, okay. I can't move. You must fight this for me. Dude, if that just hit a 254, I'm fucked. How convenient for you. I'm happy you don't have to do as much. I'm already hit a 17. If it hits me with magic, I'm fine. Okay, so maybe if I run back and forth... Uh, it's gotta do magic. And where's my prayer? My prayer's off. My prayer's off. It's working. It has to hit me with magic. Uh, my prayer's gone? Oh my god. I just realized it's actually draining my prayer. Oh my god, I have no food left. Fight to the death, pussy. It's me and you. Let's see what you've got. Yeah! Video games. I'm good at them. Don't you forget it. I don't really know what happened to its attack that hit a 254. I'm glad it didn't pull that one on me. But you know what? I beat it. And we saved this whole place. I think. Hopefully. I don't know. I'm just begging for the wise old man's hat as if he's gonna give it to me. Man, I remember everyone being so pissed off that he had that hat. Just knowing that he killed someone in the drainer bank and stole it. That's why my guy is begging for it. Yeah, we can catch monkfish now. And there we go. Way to capitalize the skill names. But hey, that's, uh, that's some good XP, baby. Let's keep on this momentum. We're on a roll. On in the next one.
May 22nd, 2006, Quest 106, Royal Trouble. We're going back to the Kingdom of Miscellania, which is going to be incredibly awkward because I have not been here in months. I have not tended to the people. I have not checked in on how they're doing. I have not seen my wife. I've done nothing productive for this place. This guy's gonna spit on my shoes when I pass by him. Hi, hey. Oh God, that's a lot of weeds. That is not a good looking farm. This is the most awkward part. I have to pass by my wife's room. Actually, I'm gonna go the other way. I'm not gonna pass by her room. We're gonna play this smart. Don't talk to me. Don't look at me. Grim, don't. Don't talk loud. She can't know I'm here, okay? Greetings, Royal High- Shut up, shut up, shut up. What the fuck? It would appear that war is about to break out because I haven't been here to control anything. I leave for a little bit, everything goes to shit. What do you know? Grim wants me to talk to the prince and princess to find out more about the situation. Princess Astrid's been asking about you. Oh, perfect. Uh, just groaning outside her door. All right, let's do this. Welcome back, my dear. Oh, oh, you don't want me killed. You haven't managed to find a priest for our marriage? Oh. Uh, anyway, uh, how do we stop war? What's going on there? We're talking in this room, I guess. Can't be alone. That's fine. First and foremost, who broke that chair? What happened? They're saying that they want to declare war on each other all the time. The island's a shit show per usual. Their suggestion is that we get the king here and the queen there to marry each other, uh, even though they want to kill each other, but we somehow make that happen. It's not a very good plan. It's not going to work. I'm going to have to figure this out on my own. Oh, my name is Jarton here. I forgot. They don't know me for real. These people know absolutely nothing about me. And I like that. I could get a second wife if I wanted to, but I'm not going to do that. I don't really want one wife, uh, let alone two. What the holy white ass? King Vargas is telling me people around the town have had their stuff stolen and wants us to figure out what's going on. Yeah. Okay. Don't look at me when I'm talking to you. It's not like I'm the king or anything. She's saying some soldiers from the other side came over and stole a bunch of stuff. Neither side has any organization, let alone an army, so this story doesn't really add up. I'm gonna go talk to the queen on the other side and see what's going on. She's saying people over here are claiming that we stole stuff from them. There's just not consistency here. Something's up. I have to keep investigating. All this running around got me thinking. Hey, hear me out. What if, you know, all these people on both sides of the island just kind of disappeared. I mean, clearly they're not going to amount to anything. The only reason nature hasn't taken them out naturally is because they're on this island. They're not doing anything for anyone. And if I had this island to myself, I'd have all these resources. I'd have a cozy place, two castles. <sighs> Let's see what this guy has to say. Yeah, this guy's saying soldiers on our side stole stuff. This is just a shit show. I would make a lot better use of this island. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Oh, excuse me, sir. There is, uh, there's something on your foot. It's a dead bunny. Have a good day. The miscellaneous quests have such an obnoxious amount of running around. Let me speed us through this to move along quicker. Grimm said to talk to the sailor to see if anyone from outside the island has been around. He said to ask the king about the relic of teenagers in a dungeon. The king said, yeah, there's teenagers and there's a dungeon. I went to that dungeon. I talked to a dwarf in a bar who gave me a stick. Yep. I went inside a little cave and built a pulley system to lift me up deeper into a cave. And then I continued the investigation. Well, 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 what do we have here? A charred diary. Read it at your own peril. If you steal this book, my dad will beat you up. Fuck. I'm sorry. More fire. More pages. It belongs to some relic of teenagers going through the Fremenic trials. What are they doing down here? Those trials must have changed a lot. Why'd they make so many fires so close to each other? What are they doing? <gasps> They're talking about me here. They wanted to make peace with these kingdoms, but I already did it and I married the daughter. Maybe it's way cooler than I thought it was. Yeah, the teenagers dressed up as soldiers and stole people's shit. They tried to start a war so that they could pretend to make peace. These kids are starting to piss me off. Oh, there they are. Look at them. They're trying to fuck up my kingdom. The funny thing is, is I've already passed my Fremenic trials. I have jurisdiction over them. I'll have them publicly executed. Someone's coming. Hey, it's me, Byerly. I found your diary. Yeah, I read the whole thing. You know, only little crybaby babies writing diaries, right? Yeah, I'm gonna tell your dad about it too and how you dotted the eyes with hearts. Oh, he's gonna love it. Their big plan to save the kingdoms got ruined by a big snake at the end of this tunnel. I should be thanking the snake, but instead I'm just gonna kill it. Should be through here. Oh, there it is. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, I don't think this fight it's gonna be nearly as adrenaline pumping as the last one. Man, I have gotten strong. 22? 23? The strength training's paying off, man. I I am unstoppable. Shh, it's okay. It's okay. They, wow, that was violent. Hey, a box. That's, uh, I'm guessing this has all the people's stolen shit in it, maybe? All right, let's get out of here, tell the queen and king, and uh, put some teenagers on trial, huh? Just told the queen a bunch of teenagers did it. I got everyone's stuff back, so she gave me 20k and a letter to take to the king. I just got back to the king. Apparently that letter was talking about how she actually has a crush on him and stuff and how they're not that different and they should join forces. So I guess they're gonna get together after all, which is great for me. Except it would appear that not only now I need to manage miscellanea, but also that shithole over there too. But I do get more resources, so I guess that's fine. But I don't use this enough. I should probably start using this again. We did it. 
were awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and call it there. I know this is a shorter episode, but I couldn't fit the next one in without delaying the episode another week. The next two quests are gonna give us access to the Dorgashun crossbow and fairy rings, so I'm getting pumped up, baby. Also, I plan on playing Trailblazers League on stream, so make sure you guys are following on Twitter and Twitch to catch those guys. If I'm gonna leave you with one thing today, just remember, I am a god at video games. Bye,